Discord is a free voice IP app that gamers mostly use to talk to each other on a Windows PC. You can talk to your video game teammates by voice chat or send them text messages through the web app or a separate app, even though this platform is pretty stable. Some users encounter issues with it like when the app won't open at all. In this video, we'll show you how to fix Discord if it's not loading. It is highly advised that you restart your computer before attempting any of the troubleshooting actions that are detailed in this video. This procedure restarts the operating system and deletes any corrupt temporary data that may be contributing to the issue that you are experiencing. Sometimes, you won't be able to relaunch the app because an old version of it is still running in the background. To fix this, use the task manager to close all instances of the app that are running. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus Del on the keyboard. Select task manager from the blue screen back options that appear in the task manager window. Find and click on Discord among the listed services under apps. Click on the end task button appearing in the bottom right hand corner of the task manager window. Wait for the services to terminate. web browser or the Windows app can both be used to get to Discord. If the problem happens when you're using the app, try signing into your account through the browser. Try using the Discord app once this is done. Most of the people who have had this problem have taken this step to fix it. If your computer is set to the wrong time, Discord might also not open. Right click on the digital time in the bottom right of the Windows task menu and select the just date time in the date and time window. Make sure the set time automatically option is toggle to on. Restart the PC and launch Discord. The proxy is one way to hide where you are right now, which helps you stay anonymous. This will, however, change how Discord works. So if you are using a proxy, you should try to turn it off. Right click on the Windows Start menu and click on Search in the Search field. Type Control Panel and select the option with the same name from the search results. Choose Network and Internet from the Control Panel options. Click on Internet Options. In the Internet Properties window that appears, click on the Connections tab among the options running vertically along the top of the screen. On the Local Area Network Settings section, click on LAN Settings. When the Local Area Network Settings appears, Find the proxy server section and ensure the use of proxy server for your LAN option is unticked. Click OK below. Then once more in the Internet Properties window, launch Discord. If the problem isn't fixed by the steps earlier, try uninstalling the Discord app and then reinstalling it. Right click on the Windows Start menu and click on Settings. In the Windows Settings window, click on Apps. The sixth icon in the list, under Apps and Features, find the entry for Discord and click on it. In the expanded menu, click on Uninstall. Follow the steps in the Uninstall wizard. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.